Hi and welcome back to a quick tutorial. Here we're going to be talking about how to uh, play about with the sequencer in Nexus, which I do quite a lot. Uh, so it's quite useful if you want to grab a bass line or some drums and change them up a bit. When you open up the, uh, the synth, you have your library and then you can choose a, a sequence. I chose sequencer chill time in, in the deep house. So we want to go to arpeggiator and then here you'll see all the layers here laid out. Right, and um, four and five is the base. So we've got to four here. So if I want to modify this, just move that up there. Just make me this one. Let's do that a bit better. Just put that one down as well. If I can do it. Okay, so we've got that. Move them around, you can hear what they are. So this one, let's change this. Do something silly with it. So as you can see, So that's cool. So you can play around with that. And then you also you hear, if you go to the main, you can change up and have different sequences going on. Which basically if I undo that, um, and that, if you want to go say to layer one, so where's this one that's out of key? Here. This search sorry. You can change the actual sequence of that special layer. You have presets of that actual layer, I mean. You have presets of you know that you can play around with here. And then you can actually save that as your own sequence and uh, you know do something really funky. Uh, so there you have it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like, subscribe, and I will talk to you soon. Ciao.